Yeah, so what do we want to leave behind for our future generations? The sea is that way and it's going to be coming this way. In a few years time, where I'm right now, that'll be underwater. As the ice caps begin to melt, it's going to come coming this way. Ladies and gentlemen, we need that and act soon. Welcome to Pitwater. This is uh, the known as the Pitwater Basin, actually, and uh, as you can see, the tide's going out. But 10,000 years ago, before the ice melted, this was the valley. When the ice melted, the sea levels rose and filled the valley. So, as you can see, imagine if you were living there. Mate, your home would be underwater by now. Yes, and also what will happen in climate change, the diversity of the planet would change. We would go from temperate rainforests, which we are here at this point of time. And uh, what that means is that all oh, this could change. Uh, some animals will adapt and survive, others probably not. Climate change also will cause extinction, but then some species will survive. Yes, there have been human extinctions in the past. Sixty odd thousand years ago, we were not the only people that inhabited this planet. The most well known other human species was the Neanderthals, as well as Homo erectus, plus several other species, like the hobbit which was found recently in Indonesia. Yes, so we were not alone. 60,000 years ago. What happened to the Neanderthal? What happened to all the other human species that roamed the planet at the same time our kind did? Scientists are not really quite sure. Was it because maybe they couldn't bridge the gap between two different worlds, our kind and theirs? Maybe they couldn't cope with the changes in the climate and thus died out. Maybe we hunted them into extinction. That's a distinct possibility. Ladies and gentlemen, the scientists are really not sure, but I believe they're still working on to find the answer. But the question we have to ask ourselves, where are we headed as a human species? And I'm standing at the high point on the peninsula, and behind me is Whale Beach. And, uh, 30,000 years ago, before the last ice age ended, this would have been a valley. This would have been all land. As you can see now, when the ice melted, this is what happened. The sea came in. That's what happens when the sea comes in from the ice.